r slash ask reddit what would be the first thing you'd do after winning the lottery get a lawyer delete facebook never tell a single person show up to work as if nothing wild has happened silently finance firefly season 2 move out to the middle of nowhere as to never be bothered again get a lawyer to help safeguard the winnings this is also to set up the money to make more for you many winners go into financial ruin thinking their winnings was enough to retire early this is the best answer and advice i have come across regarding winning the lotto https colon slash slash www.reddit.com slash r slash ask reddit slash comments slash 24 vo 34 slash what's underscore the underscore happiest underscore five word underscore sentence underscore you underscore could underscore here slash chb4 yin slash post this exact question your timing makes me wonder are you suggesting that many americans may spend their stimulus checks irresponsibly bunch of hookers and cocaine jk i'd pay off my parents mortgage Put 100k away for a rainy day. Invest the rest in real estate. Maybe buy a new laptop too. I would ask everyone I know to give me or loan me $1000. They would all decline because it's not smart to loan money to someone like that. Whatever their response will be my response when they come asking. Collect my money. Told my kids. I'd immediately disappear and build a house. With a most around it. Put alligators in the moat. And have chimpanzees with machine guns patrolling the grounds. Seriously though. I'd only be available via email. Except for them. Till I figured things out. I'd imagine a bunch of relationships are gonna be destroyed when I don't become their free bank. Settle my debts. Then settle my enemies. Draw up a plan of how security and relative secrecy can be maintained for the rest of my life. I'd obviously remain anonymous. Also if you ever do win and decide to share your winnings with friends and family. Never tell anyone how much you've won. That way whether you give them £10 K or £1,000,000 they'll never be able to judge complain that you gave them too little. I think most winners overlook these two key points. Take a shit in my boss's desk. Buy a huge ass house and make videos of the sacrifices I'm making my parking my private jet and staying home. Buy a wee farm up in the hills. Couple of acres of woodland. Then breed wild boar and pheasants. Separately. I'm not a monster. To make sausages out of. Hire a tax attorney. Hire a lawyer. Claim it anonymously. Second. Talk to a financial planner and set a fiscal plan for life. Third. Probably go on vacation. Go get a new dust filter for my Hoover Max Extract Pressure Pro Model 60. Find that reddit post that tells me what to do after I win the lottery. Live an average life even though I'm rich. Never tell anyone. Just vibe. Forever stay in my house and pay for food, electricity, games etc with the money. Depends on how much I win. I suppose. Buy a lottery ticket. I'm on a hot streak baby. Find out how much money the government is gonna poach, then proceed to make kickers plans. How much money? 100? A nice dinner 1000? A nice heroin? Find a way to use this money to produce more money. Probably breathe. Maybe blink. Book a trip to the Caribbean. Claim the money. Go to Disneyland. Oh. Buy a house and pay bills and stuff. I'd also hire a team to do a complete remake of Legend of Dragoon and make new DLC. Hire Gordon Ramsay to cook some Paul Prud home recipes for me. I've only been lucky enough to win the lowest amount anyone can win. Four dollars I believe. Two or three times. Those times I just bought another ticket. But as a thought exercise if I win a multi-million dollar jackpot. I would hire a lawyer and financial advisor to set up a trust account so I can claim the prize as a trustee. Not individual winner. As some state laws differ. I would anonymize myself further by claiming the prize in a giant Gumby suit. So not to have my picture taken as a winner and under the name of a random trust that had no bearing to my life. 
I would then set up multiple family trusts at community banks so that I could add family members as trustees and disperse the money under the yearly gift tax. While collecting interest on the bulk of it. Then buy a place with high security where nobody can find me. To live my days in peace. In my country the win is tax free so you only have to pay taxes if the money is working in funds or stocks so fuck that put it in my normal account buy the stuff I need and living the best life without stress. Hiring a lawyer to establish a trust to claim the winnings so that I can stay anonymous. Not the first thing I'd do. But I'd definitely end up doing Mr. Beast style antics. Finding fun ways to give money away to random strangers. Can't imagine that ever getting boring. Quit my stupid ass job. I won the lottery last week. You have no idea how great it felt. I used half of it in one day on cocaine. Of course I only won $15. But hey. Blow all the money so fast that by the time people figure out I won. There's no money left. Put on clean underwear. Two chicks at the same time. Delete all social media accounts and lawyer the fuck up. Obligatory. Depending on the amount. I would buy a tropical island and be naked on the beach for the rest of my life. Buy a house in the country and have a gorgeous vegetable and flower garden. Or pay off bills so I didn't have to live with debt every damn day. Collect the money. Bus a nut. I need post nut clarity for decisions like this. Give it to my fellow middle class, working class, and low income brothers and sisters. Use it to take down the uber rich and take the means of production. Thus, bringing us into a new era. Go and turn a somersault and sing I've got a golden ticket. Call my accountant. Establish a trust. Pull a kisasos. Wipe my parents debts and give them a comfortable life. Thieve both struggled their entire lives and done everything for my sisters and I. Give some of it away. I like making people happy. After I saw someone's eyes light up with recognition and thanks for their gift. I'd get me a gaming PC. Lawyer up. Financial advisor up. Pay off debt. Give away everything but the essentials. 3 days at the Mayo Clinic getting the executive level physical. Every test imaginable. Poured over by the best and brightest to make sure there's nothing going on that's going to mess up phase 2. Phase 2. 3-4 months at the minimum in the presidential suite of a 5 star resort. My team of trainers. Medical and mental health professionals and personal chef get me in the best shape possible for someone my age. The minor cosmetic surgeries are healing well. Phase 3. I lease an amazing home on the ocean. I locate a local personal trainer to keep me on task. My rep at the Pebble Beach Tour de Elegance finds me an awesome 60s convertible. Not too crazy. I don't want to kill myself. I casually text my first crush, who's still beautiful by the way, and we meet for a drink. This goes well. Trust me. This goes well. Phase 4. Time to travel. I suggest to said crush I was thinking of doing some island hopping through the Mediterranean. My yacht and crew are standing by in Monaco. Wanna join me? This goes well. Trust me. This goes well. Phase 5. Whatever we want. I'd probably go and crank one out. I'd want that post nut clarity for big decisions. Give it to my parents because I have nothing better to do with it and I'm underaged. Feed people. Lots of them. Give my wife half then leave. Hire a wealth management consultant and a lawyer. Buy tank. Start a charity like the politicians do. Buy my way into congress. Fuck shit up. Buy Fortnite. And delete it. Helicopter my dick for 5 solid minutes. Oh. Wait. That's the second thing. First I have to drive to the office. Pay the taxes on it. Pay off my debt and then maybe have enough left over for a good meal. Sign the ticket. Meditate. Find a financial planner. I have a more detailed plan in my journal just in case. So I don't act brand new when it happens lol. Move to a different state. Or maybe different country depending on US election results in November. Please vote. People. 
post on Reddit asking people what would be the first thing they would do after winning the lottery. Deposit my money in my savings account. I don't think I'd touch it for a few days. I like to wait on buying things for a bit. So I'd probably work. Start making a plan with my folks and partner about what to pay off first. Get a reputable tax attorney to help guide us. See if I could move it all to a high yield savings account. And see what I could do each year with the my normal salary and the accrued interest. Probably start planning annual vacations. Maybe check out first class. Continue my life with the same quality and get some investments. Open a theme park with blackjack and hookers. On second thought forget about the theme park. Put at least half in a savings account to assure I don't get absolutely fucked by taxes the next year. Pay off my mom's medical bills and give her the retirement that she lost because of it. And if I can afford it after that. Buy a house with apartments that isn't too big to take care of and live in one. Rent out the others. For fun. I'd like a decent sound studio too for music. If it was one of the real big lotteries I'd even go back to school to research psychedelics. Hire a lawyer and a financial planner. Then proceed to bang both lawyer and financial planner's hot daughters. Dig up that old reddit thread on how to survive winning the lottery.